Goshen was the catalyst, but all it did was bring to the forefront some problems that we're having. I'm concerned about the Chinese ties, um, not because of the Chinese people, but because of the Chinese government um, and the things that I've researched about them. But even if it were an American company, I don't want to live three miles away from a factory. Most of the people that I talk to are very against Goshen, myself included, and for a number of different reasons. We're a rural farming community. It's quiet, it's peaceful, there's environmental concerns, there's the affiliation with the uh, Chinese Communist Party. That's, that's what I'm hearing from the residents. There's all sorts of security reasons that can, can, can be brought up in the area here. It's a pretty strategic location. You have, uh, you have a military training base, which, which we are training uh, Taiwanese soldiers right now, and not, too, not more than 100 miles from here. So it's very easy to get to. Um, we also have an airport. I don't know why they want to build right next to an airport or even talk about expanding an airport. The only reason to expand an airport would be to be able to line, you know, fly a bigger planes in. With the tension between America and, and China, uh, is, is we saw things like the, the most recent big, made big news was a Chinese spy balloon. Uh, there's been concern about the Chinese infiltration into buying up a lot of farmland in our country, very near military installations. There's been concern about um, intellectual properties in our colleges and universities as far as that industry, the high-tech industry. 